In the wake of four militant attacks in three days in the region, Prime Minister Narendra Modi directed the officials to deploy the full spectrum of India's counter-terror capabilities to handle the situation in Jammu and Kashmir. Ajit Doval has been appointed as a national security advisor for the third time. Kerala government said that 24 people from the state died in Wednesday's apartment in Verno in Kuwait. One person was killed and five others went missing in Sikkim as heavy rains wreaked havoc across the state this week, triggering multiple landslides. Prime Minister Narendra Modi on Thursday chaired a review meeting of the security situation in Jammu and Kashmir, where he was apprised of the counter-terror efforts being undertaken in the Union territory. The meeting comes in the wake of four militant attacks in three days in the region. In the meeting, attended by National Security Advisor and other officials, Modi was given a full overview of the security-related situation in Jammu and Kashmir. He was also briefed on the efforts being undertaken by the local administration. The Prime Minister directed the officials to deploy the full spectrum of India's counter-terror capabilities to handle the situation. The Kerala government said on Thursday that 24 people from the state died in Wednesday's apartment inferno in Kuwait's Mangaf area. The cabinet in a special meeting decided to give a relief of 5 lakh rupees each to the families of the Keralites who perished in the Kuwait tragedy. The injured people will be given 1 lakh rupees each. But why do so many young workers from Kerala migrate to the Gulf despite poor working conditions? The Indian Express spoke to the chair of International Institute of Migration and Development, Irudaya Rajan, on this and this is what he had to say. The narrative is very, very simple. They are earning more than what they can earn in India. That's it. They are earning more than what they can earn in India. At least in the official terms. They have been sold dreams by the agents. If you are earning 20,000 rupees as a driver, if you go there, you can earn 1 lakh. So you are earning 5 times more. Former IPS officer Ajit Doval was appointed as a national security advisor for the third time as per a government order issued on Thursday. The Cabinet Appointments Committee order stated that Doval's appointment is co-terminus with the term of the Prime Minister Narendra Modi or until further orders, whichever is earlier. His third term came into effect from the 10th of June. During the term of his office, Doval will be assigned the rank of cabinet minister in the table of precedence as per the order and the terms and conditions of his appointment will be notified separately. One person was killed and five others went missing in Sikkim as heavy rains wreaked havoc across the state this week, triggering multiple landslides that have severed access to northern Sikkim. With the Tista River overflowing, several people have been left homeless. Landslides have caused widespread devastation in Upper Gyanthang and Tarag villages where houses have been destroyed. A vital road connecting the district headquarters in Mangan was also blocked after a landslide hit, said officials. And finally, even as Delhi reels under a severe water crisis, the Indian Express photographer Tashi Tobgyal has captured some moments of joy.